is up everybody welcome back to another episode of fortnite battle royale cheeseburger eddie here hope you guys are having a fantastic day and i hope you guys are enjoying the content we're providing if so i need you to go ahead and leave a like on the video subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done so and turn on those post notifications for anybody that's new tune in for at least five minutes man you have a great time we're gonna have a good Little video for you guys, a little information, a little, little entertainment, and just making sure we're providing value uh, to anyone that's going to devote some time to the channel. So I definitely appreciate you guys tuning in, and let's get right into it. Now, obviously, we're going to talk about something that's been done before, uh, but hopefully be able to kind of put a little different twist on it. Wanted to kind of give you guys all the information uh, of, of the fish in the game, Fortnite. You know, if you're not familiar with Fortnite uh, and you haven't played, especially in the recent seasons... There's fish, and you can fish, and there is a diverse section of fish. In total, I think there are now 41 fishes, or fish, uh, plural, I, I, I don't understand it, but there's 41 fish total uh, after an upcoming update. Um, previously, there was 39, but they added two, and we're going to talk about all of them, and we're going to try to get you guys a win by healing only, a challenge that has, again, done, been done before, but not to this extent, man. I'm telling you, we're going to go fishing. We're going to make sure we find all the good stuff and kind of just give you guys some entertainment today. Uh, as you guys can see, the shark out here in the water, be careful. He comes at you for no reason. You'll see it later in the episode. But let's jump right into it, talk about the different types of fishes, man, and get right into the, in the story here. So the first type of fish is obviously the most common, uh, which is the small fry. Now, there's di uh, different colors of these small fries, but they all do the same thing. Uh, that's the blue, the black, the purple top, the tan small, and the light blue small fry. Now, the small fry is a tiny little fish that all they do is they heal you up 25 health up until you're at 75 health. So just like a bandage can only get take you up to 75, a small fry can only take you up to 75. Now, with that being said, the small fry is a very quick consumable, so it's very you know handy to have in certain situations. It might be beneficial for you guys to have in your inventory if you guys are playing a healing type game. You know, look at this shark coming at me. What are you doing, man? Get out of here. I'm not even messing with you. I don't even have a gun. Well, okay, I do have a gun, but I'm not I'm not getting them, okay? Haven't messed with him. Alright, next fish. The uh, thermal fish. And the different colors or different types of thermal fish are the purple and orange, the red and green, the raven, the silver in the green uh, thermal fish. And what the thermal fish does is grant a player temporary uh, thermal vision. And what you guys will see here in a moment uh, going forward is me using the thermal uh, vision to our advantage. You can basically see players from a far distance away. It gives you a little bit of an advantage because uh, it shows just nothing but black and white on the screen. It's It can be beneficial. I don't think it's the greatest thing in the world. So. I'm not a big fan. I'm not going to use it in my strategy when I'm trying to play games uh, going forward. Next on the list is the shield fish. Now with the shield fish, there is the light blue, the green, the pink, the black striped, the black and blue, which that's the that's it. I mean, that's all the blue, uh, the, the shield fish. And what the shield fish does is just basically just grants you a 50 shield. So just like a shield pod would grant you 50. A, uh, a, a shield fish is going to grant you 50 shield. And you can obviously have two, get up to 100, boom, you're done. Uh, simple enough. The next one on the list is a jellyfish. Now, with the jellyfish, there are, again, quite a few different ones. There's the purple, the peely, the cuddle, the dark vanguard, and the slurp uh, jellyfish. I don't know why they <clears throat> took a left turn and started naming them different things other than colors. Uh, the Peely, the Cuddle, and the Dark Vanguard, and the Slurp. But it is what it is. As you guys can see in the video, the, that's the thermal. That's the thermal fish right there. Boom. You can see it. Black and white. It's easy. It's cool. It's whatever. Uh, so, yeah. The, the jellyfish, basically what they do is you can squish them and give all players in the vicinity 20 health. Uh, pretty similar to the just the spluce juices that you can throw on the ground and everyone near you gets the, the health or the shield. Um, so that's going to be it. Just squashing and gives you players 20 health in the vicinity. The next type of fish we are going to talk about today is the hopper fish. Uh, with the hop hoppers, I guess is what they call them in this game, there is the chum hop, the chin hook, the Atlantic hop, the coho hop, and the drift hop. Now again, all these different names, they're just different colors, different varieties of the fish. I don't think there's any differences between the actual fish itself. Uh, on these ones, the, the rare ones, we'll get into a little bit deeper, but 
These fish are just basically just different colors. So again, the chum hop, the chin hook, the Atlantic, coho and the drift uh, hop are all uh, flop or hop floppers, which just basically grants you a temporary low gravity effect. Not sure if you guys remember back in chapter one when you were able to grab the crystals out of the divot, you'd consume the crystal or just use the crystal and it would give you that low gravity effect for quite a little bit of time. Uh, or you can just jump higher and not take any damage if you jumped off something high up above. Uh, so that's gonna be the hop hoppers fish. Now the next one are the spicy fish, which are gonna contain the molten spicy fish, the sky blue, the southern, and the white spotted along with the drift spicy fish. Again, just different colors. It looks like a, a puffer fish, I'm not, if I'm not mistaken. And what those do is they heal you 15 health and it gives you a temporary speed boost. So if anyone's familiar with the peppers in the game, if you eat a pepper, uh, it gives you that quickness, that speed while your ears are ringing because it's so hot. That's exactly what the spicy fish does. It gives you a little bit of health by, in a, as well as giving you a speed boost. Pretty cool feature, whatever, let's move on. Next on the list is the slurp fish. There is the white, the black, the purple, the yellow, and the blue slurp fish. What the slurp fish do is they heal you 50 health or and shield. Okay, I got that backwards on this article. It's and or shield up to both 100 health and shield. So each fish heals you 50, whether it's, so let's just say you're at, you know, 75 health total, you'll get 25 uh, total health plus 25 shield. Totals up to 50 up until you're at a, a max heal of 100 health and 100 shield. Pretty cool thing, slurp fish. Again, the ones are the, let me see, the white, the black, the purple, the yellow, and the blue. Uh, those are the different type of slurp fish. Now going into the last main topic of, of fish is the flopper, um, which are gonna be construed uh, of, I guess, construed, what am I talking about? They're gonna be, uh, the okay, let's just get into it. The flopper, okay, there's the blue flopper, the green, the orange, uh, which are the main three. And what those do is they heal you 40 health points up until you're 100 health. Uh, so if you ever had you know, a strategy late game where you're uh, boxing up and it becomes a heal battle, floppers are very beneficial to have. They give you 40 quick health points up to 100 health, and you can stack, I think, up to four in each, each slot. So pretty easy, pretty great to have um, going in the, in the final, uh, final fishes. Now the last few that I wanna talk about there Two of which are floppers and one is a goldfish. The fl other floppers are the Vendetta flopper and the Midas flopper. So the Vendetta flopper, which is pretty rare in its own right, is a fish you consume and it marks nearby enemies' locations. Now I've never seen this fish in action, my, in action myself, uh, but basically I'm assuming that when you eat it, it's just like when someone targets or, or marks somebody uh, or when you grab an en enemy that's already down, you can kind of find where their, their enemy or their teammate is. Uh, I'm guessing that's exactly what the Vendetta Flopper does. I'm not sure if it gives you any health. The article doesn't say anything about it. It just says a fish said to mark nearby enemies' locations. So whatever, not a big fan of that one. Let's move on. The Midas Flopper, which is one of the rare ones again. This is one of the rarest ones, if I'm not mistaken. I think the two top rare ones are the Midas Flopper and then the last one, the goldfish that we're gonna talk about. Uh, the Midas Flopper is an upcoming fish that it's, I believe is in the game. I think they updated it recently. Uh, said to turn your entire inventory into legendary rarity. So if, for example, I was playing the game, it wouldn't really benefit me because I don't have any weapons in my inventory other than one. Uh, but if you have, let's say, a gray um, rifle, you have a gray shotgun, and you have a gray sniper or blue sniper rifle, or whatever you may ha might have, if you obtain the Midas flopper, your entire inventory turns into a legendary rarity. Awesome to have. I can see it being very beneficial. Boom, that's it. I mean, that's that's the end of that one. So Midas Flopper, very rare. And again, I don't know how often it comes into the game, but pretty cool if you guys have seen it or if you've been a part of any of these. Let me know in the comments down below. And if you're getting any informational value out of this, if you're if you're seeing some, some fun times, a part of the group, make sure to check out some other videos. Make sure to leave a like on the, on the video. Make sure to subscribe to the channel and make sure you turn on those post notifications to know when I post videos, which is fairly frequently right now. I'm staying as consistently as possible. I hope you guys stay a part of this community. We're growing. Again, we're at 39 people. I love it. I want to see more. Let's go. Into the last one, the Mythic Goldfish. So this is another one, the, one of the two that was updated into the game recently. The Mythic Goldfish is the rarest item in the entire game, uh, or the rarest fish, I'll say, because uh, I'm not too familiar with everything else. The mythic goldfish, an extremely rare fish, about one in a million chance 
that will instantly kill enemies on contact. So basically what happens with this fish, and again, I have not seen any gameplay with it, I've not seen any action, any clips of it whatsoever, but when you obtain this fish, I guess it turns into a weapon of some type, and when anyone comes into in, uh, contact with you, if you get into a certain, you know, I guess, throw range or whatever, uh, a range within the enemy, uh, they instantly die. It does 200 damage, which is the max amount of damage anybody can have in the game, or max amount of HP health points that you can have in the game, uh, so they instantly die. Um, I guess if you're if you're a part of a team, you could go down and then obviously go uh, get killed after fact after the fact. But again, it is a one in a million chance that you are going to get this. If any of you guys find this mystic or mythic goldfish, leave a comment down below. I would love to check your channel out and see what you guys are, what you've seen because I think that'd be absolutely awesome to experience. That sounds like that would just be fun. I feel like that's that's a, an amazing uh, addition to the game that just kind of creates a different meta and a different a different strategy to the game obviously you know i don't think you're going to see anyone in competitive fortnite playing professionally that's going to go after the Mi the mythic goldfish or the midas flopper or anything uh because normally they're going to go just straight for looting the material that they need and then obviously getting whatever weapons uh that they can throughout the game so again that is the list that is the 41 uh different fish that are in the game uh, if that, if you guys want to hear more about it, I doubt it, but if you guys enjoyed it, if you guys want to talk about something else, let me know in the comments down below. We're going to finish this gameplay, man. Obviously, we had to end up shooting people because they were shooting at us, and I didn't get killed, but Alex did, and he's got a couple now. So, hey, we're top five, top four now, and we're going to get a win for you guys. So, stay tuned. Here we go. Let's get this action going. Yeah, I need you guys to go ahead and smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, and make sure to turn on post notifications. We are awaiting Galactus. Coming into the map, the big updates that have been ha taking place on a weekly basis, I cover them as frequently as anybody, so make sure you tune in to your boy Cheeseburger Eddie every single chance you get to, to just, just to figure it out, to see what's going on, but also to have a great time. That's what we're about here. Positive energy, fun time, just great gameplay and commentary. Let's do this as a team. Let's get together and have a great time, man. And also, I say it a lot. I say it in a couple of my other videos. Make sure to show some love to my teammate, Alex Ortiz. His gamer tag is up there in the far left corner, left-hand top corner. Uh, he's my boy. He's another YouTuber. He posts uh, Fortnite and, and Rocket League videos, sometimes called the Warzone videos. Uh, and he's just a great guy, great YouTuber. He's putting a lot of energy in his in his, uh, in his his craft, and I think it's going to show for him uh, pretty soon. So we're up-and-coming YouTubers. I need you guys to show some love to us and, and get us there, man. I'm not talking about a million subscribers. I'm just talking about getting me to 50 and I'm going to start showing you guys some love. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to start showing you guys how to do this thing correctly, how we play this game, and how we get wins almost on a daily basis. Not every day do we get a win, but almost every day we get a win. Now, let's just talk about the gameplay situation we're in right now. I thought it was 2v2, but apparently it's 1v1v2. So we're in a good spot. But as you guys, if you return, if you're returning viewers, you've seen before, we have been clapped by a solo player before. So let's not get too cocky, and let's get into a good spot. So I'm going to build... A little, you know, a little erratically, erratically here, and just you know, I'm gonna try to take him down. So let's let's just break out the little thing. Thank gosh, I uh, we got a peek out, you know, picked up a, a weapon, first of all, and thank goodness Alex uh, had as much you know, ammo as he did because if it wasn't for him, I wouldn't have been winning this game. You know what I'm saying? But here we go. So it's the final uh, two v one v one, and I believe what you're gonna see here is me. I'm gonna coach and look. They ain't getting out of this little hole. They're going to die from the gas. That's my goal because I ain't trying to get a single kill. I'm trying to get the lowest amount of everything uh, possible. I'm trying to have it become a heal battle because I got the fish to back it up. But it ain't going to work that way, man. We're going to make sure that this is a great game for you guys. So I need you guys to stay tuned. There's only a few minutes left. If if that. I mean, we're, we're getting to the final little circle here. You know what I'm saying? Let's let's see if we can get you guys this win. You know what I'm saying? I love you guys so much, man. I hope you guys know that. I hope you guys understand how just amazing i feel like everyone that's been showing the support showing the love i know a lot of it's my family members uh my friends but there's a lot of you guys that are just you know a part of the youtube community that i've never met in person that i just want to thank you know just the, the positivity you guys are bringing the absolute just you know fun and enjoyment you guys are bringing to my life along with this community i mean i just imagine this one day if we're up at 500 subscribers or if we're up at up at a you know a thousand subscribers and, and goodness gracious let's think even further than that like you know, however big we might get one day. But just think how amazing this community is and how positive we're going to be to each other every single day. It's going to be a great time, man. Let's let's build this out together. So make sure if you're new, I need you to show some love. I need you to become a part of the most positive and greatest community 
in all of gaming, in all of YouTube, in all of Fortnite. We're not the greatest gamers. We're not the best gamers. You know what I'm saying? We're not going to provide you guys, you know, professional level play. But we're going to get you guys some wins. We're going to get you guys some very educational. In uh oh, uh oh. We're going to get you guys some very educational videos, very you know, fun videos, and obviously, once in a while. We might just provide you guys a win here and there. Not that we posted like three or four wins in the last couple of weeks. But hey, we'll be there. But here we go. Last guy on the map. And we are going to... We're going to do it. Boom. That's it, man. Victory Royale. I love you guys so much. I appreciate you guys tuning in. Hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Make sure to like, subscribe, and comment down below for more content. And I'll see you in the next one. Take it easy, everybody. Peace.